always things going on. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, like like even with with Kanye not dropping Donda, like there's obviously reasons. Like people thought it was just like for for the uh, the theatrics of it all at some point. But for me, I appreciate that what Kanye's doing. I think I, I learned to appreciate it. At first, it was irritating me because I'm like, bro, drop the album, bro, drop the album. Like, there's no, I was talking to a friend about this the other day. It's like there is no other situation in life where you can just you can where where somebody can just play with your emotions like that and it just lead to nothing. Like, and you still wait wait for them to keep playing with your emotions, right? So it's like this, this Donda album was supposed to drop months ago, and it's like he it's like imagine a girl come to your crib. She says she gonna come to your crib, right? So the girl she pulls to your crib, woo woo. She knocks at your door. She's like, oh yeah, what's going on? I'm here right now, right? So boom, she got a robe on. She got just a robe on. She ain't got nothing under the robe, right? She got just a robe on. She walk in the crib, robe on, nothing under the robe. Y'all about to get real frisky. Y'all on the couch. Y'all about to get into it, right? And then she take off the robe. You about to start touching the feeling, and then she put back on the robe and she leave. And she be like, oh, I'll be back next week. What? Imagine, are you waiting for that girl to come back next week, please? Let me know in the comments down below. Are you waiting for that girl to come back? If you wait for that girl to come back, I'm sorry, you might be a simp. I'm not gonna, you might be a simp. Because it's like, what are you talking about? You you want me to wait for you for next week? You came in my crib with a robe on, no clothes. I was about to get to handsy, you know what I'm saying? My hands was about to get to bother builder and I was about to start tetrising. We was going to start moving the group. And then you was going to put the robe back on and dip. And then tell me I'm back next week. I'm sorry. There's no other arena where where things like this can happen. Why are we just allowing this to happen? I don't get it. Why do we care? I'm not gonna lie. Why do I care? Before before we, I'm gonna touch on Doja Cat now too in a little bit, a couple seconds. But I just want to know why do we care about all the theatrics? The only theatrics about the Donna thing that I say that was kind of cool was the whole like because uh, I, I I like creative stuff obviously. Um, so I appreciated the whole uh, 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 he he made his old childhood house. And then, like, set himself on fire. I think that was kind of cool. That was creative. I, I don't think anybody's out here doing stuff like like that of that nature. You know what I'm saying? So, shout out to him on that. Um, I think that was type different. But at the end of the day, like I said, drop the album, bro. Drop the album. I don't give a damn. Drop the album, bro. Drop the album. Like, all these theatrics is cool woo -woo, for, like, music history. I like music history. Dope. Awesome. Drop the album, bro. Drop the album. Who cares? Like, drop the album, bro. Drop the album. Drop the album, bro. Drop the album, bro. Like, drop the album. But... I want to talk about Doja Cat now, okay? Doja Cat, I did not know that we all of a sudden was like, oh, snap, Doja Cat uncanceled. I was talking to 